So the next thing you've got to do is basically take the camera, the pictures that are on the camera, and put them into the iPad. Again, you can do that if you have an iPhone, they automatically uh, move over into the iPad without you even having to do anything. Most of the tablets out there will allow you to take pictures with their tablet, and so you don't have to move anything. I don't choose to take pictures with the iPad 2, though I could because they just aren't very good quality and I like to have good quality pictures in my report. So what I'm going to do now is basically move the pictures from over here into here. It happens very, very quickly. I carry around with me a camera connection kit that you can buy at any Walmart or any Apple store. Okay, It's very easy. You plug it in the top here. I'm going to open up the camera and stick and stick the, uh, the SD card in there. It automatically says, hey, do you want to import all? Sure enough, skip the duplicates because I already have those on there. And it's going to import them. As you can see, the uh, check marks are showing that they are importing. These are all the pictures that I just took. It goes very, very quickly. I'm going to keep those on the card just in case. Put this all back. I can stick this back in my pocket, stick this back in my pocket, and now I've got all the pictures that I took on my inspection right here in the iPad. It happens that fast. I close the photos, open back up Phoenix Mobile, I go over to the photo section, and now I can start importing the photos in. So this one is the front photo, this one is the rear photo, this is one street scene, and on and on. So I can just put these in very, very quickly. They go very fast. At that point, I save this, and then I hit cloud, and it uploads to the cloud. Right now it's uploading to the cloud, so that when I get back to my office, my office staff has already downloaded it from the cloud, already gotten it ready, and all I have to do is start working on the appraisal. It's that easy to do. It honestly takes five more minutes to do the iPad or the other tablet to do mobile appraising takes five minutes longer than to do a paper and pencil. The real savings is I don't have to go back to the office now and retype everything and that's really where we save time and money by using mobile appraising.